Hey guys, welcome to another Gaging Gadgets Discord tutorial video. In this video, I'm going to show you how to prevent spam on your Discord server for free. So the steps in this tutorial can be used to prevent people from spamming your Discord server with curse words, emojis, anything like that. If people are spamming your server by sending a ton of messages, you can stop them from doing that automatically using this tutorial. So to prevent spam on our Discord server, we're going to be using the Me6 bot. So this is a very popular bot and most of the features on it are free. The first thing we need to do to get started is simply go to me with two E's, six dot X, Y, Z in your browser and check the description. I'll have a direct link down there as well as a detailed write up in case you get lost. So once you get here, go ahead in the top right and select login. And then you just want to grant me six access to your discord account. So make sure you're okay with this access and then go to the bottom and select authorize. Once you do that, this will bring you to the dashboard for your me six account, and it will show all the different servers that you own from here. Simply find the server that you want to prevent spam on and select set up me six. This will open up a new window where we just need to select continue. And we're going to be adding the me six bot to our server now so we can configure what access that bot has. Now it is a trusted bot, so it's up to you, but you can go through these roles and remove anything that you don't think it needs to have. Once you're done, go to the bottom and select authorize. Once you authorize the me six bot to your server, you'll be brought here to the dashboard for your server on me six. There are tons of different options in here. And if you're interested in learning more about the me six bot, check the description. Cause I do have a bunch of tutorials covering cool things you can do with it to prevent spam. All we need to do is under utilities and management, find moderator. It might be grayed out kind of like this. Go ahead and select that. And we're going to enable the plugin. So select yes. Once you have the moderator plugin enabled, scroll down until you see auto moderator right here. And this is where we can turn on the spam filters. So we have several different options in here and we'll go through them so you know how they work. So first we have bad words right here. And if you want to stop people from spamming or typing curse words, or even just any word that you want in your server, all you need to do is select the settings next to bad words, add any bad words to the list down here. So I'll just do test as an example and hit enter so that it looks like this from there, select. Okay. And now we just need to tell me six what to do when someone posts a bad word on our server. So just select the drop down right here where it says disabled and you can have it delete the message, just warn the member or delete and warn. So I'll just do delete and then go ahead and select save. The next tool we have for spam prevention on our server is going to be repeated text. And for this, all we need to do is select disabled under repeated text and just tell the me six bot what to do once it encounters that. And I'm going to have this one delete and warn. Make sure you select save. After that, we can prevent people from using excessive caps, like if they're yelling in a server. And as you can see right here, 70% of their message is all caps. It'll stop that from happening. So all we need to do is under excessive caps, select disable, and then just tell me six what you want it to do. Once that happens, I'm going to just warn users for doing that. We can also prevent people from posting excessive emojis to do that. Find excessive emojis, select settings. And then we can select how many emojis we want to have as a limit. I'm going to do two emojis just as an example. So I'll select OK, then save. And then we need to configure what the Me6 bot will do once someone breaks that rule. I'm going to just have it warn the member. The next two options for spam prevention are going to be excessive spoilers and excessive mentions. It's very similar to emojis where we go into the settings for each of these and we can set our limit for spoilers and our limit for mentions. And then you just need to go down and determine what the bot will do when that happens. So you can go ahead and do that yourself. Finally, down here, we have Zalgo. So this is a type of text that kind of looks like this right here. So if you want to ban that, all you need to do is find the drop down next to Zalgo and tell the me six bot what to do when it encounters that. So we'll select save. So they're all, those are all the auto moderator spam prevention tools on the me six bot for your discord server. Now I'll show you some examples of what those look like. So first we'll do bad words and I have the word test as my bad word. If I type that in, you can see that it quickly deleted it. Now we'll test repeated words where it's going to delete the message and warn the user. It deleted it and then it just warns me and tells me the reason it was deleted. And then now we're going to do excessive caps where it just will warn me. As you can see right there. And then finally, I'll show you emojis. And as you can see, it left the message, but warned me. All right, so that's how you stop spam on your Discord server using the Me6 bot. 
If you have any questions about this, leave a comment below. I'll get back to you as soon as I can. If you'd like to see more Discord or Me6 bot tutorial videos, check the links in the description. If this video helped you, give it a thumbs up and please consider subscribing to my channel, Gaging Gadgets, for more gadget reviews and tech tutorials. Thank you so much for watching.